Space Explorers Between the Line, qualification match number 14, starting in three, two, one, go. Let's take a look at the, what the Blue Alliance has in store during this sandstorm period. 772, the Saber Bites drive forward. They're right beside the cargo ship. Feverworks lining up a hatch panel on the front side of the cargo ship. Looks like they have it. We'll see at the start of Teleop. Looks like it'll count. That's five points to Blue there. Meanwhile, Red Alliance robots are already lined up. They get a cargo scored right at the start of Teleop there. Team Dave decided to start this match with all null panels instead of preloading any cargo. They're going to just score the cargo, get three points for every single one of those. Beaverworks now working on another front side hatch panel. Blue Alliance cargo ship is starting to fill up with game pieces thanks to the efforts of the beaver. The Saber Bites on the other side doing just as much work for the Blue Alliance. They want to score points as well. Right now, unofficially, Red Alliance is winning by only four points. It's only a couple of game pieces that will make the difference here. 777, sorry, 7722 playing defense on 772. 2609 gets another hatch panel. They're going to drive over to the Blue Alliance cargo ship on the side. They're going to line up on the middle cargo bay. We'll see what happens there. They decide they don't like it. Try again. Team Dave is continuing to fill up the Red Alliance cargo ship with cargo. Each one worth three points. It's an effective way to win a match. Beaverworks just getting shoved around by Team 7722. Meanwhile, 772 left to their own. They're going to do some scoring for the Blue Alliance on the Blue Alliance cargo ship. Team Dave continuing to try and do some scoring for the Red Alliance. The Tronic Titan saying, no, 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 we're going to try and stop you. There's only one middle bay left for the Red Alliance, and that one's good. Tronic Titan's a little late getting there. Team Dave scoring their sixth cargo there. Right now, there's only one cargo bay left for the Red Alliance cargo ship to be filled. They've got to put a hatch panel on it first. Team Dave has one in their possession right now. Here goes 2609, middle cargo bay. They get the hatch panel on. They drive away. That's good. Final 24 seconds of the match. 772. They're going to try and go all the way up to level 3. Dave is going to try and score another cargo, complete that Red Alliance cargo ship. Well done on that Red Alliance. Great effort by all the teams here. Let's see what happens on the blue side of the field. The Habitat, Beaverworks is up. 772, their wheels aren't quite making contact. They're trying to drive forward, not going anywhere. Team Dave parks at the buzzer. That will be the end of match 14. Coming up next, the scores for you in just a moment. I believe we have the scores coming up. Qualification match number 14. Indeed, the Red Alliance will take the victory. Let's look at the breakdown here. Final score, 45 for Red, 33 to Blue. A solid 24 cargo points there by the Red Alliance. Congratulations to those teams. Top ranked team there, Team Dave, moving up into ninth. Coming up next, match number 15.